Welcome everyone to Lost Miracles episode 5. You've successfully done it. You've successfully uh, destroyed the ley lines, and as a result of it, the Arbiter has fallen. It has been 10 hours, and you have about another 8 hours until the daughter of Havos arrives to this location. Oh, shit. As you have been preparing and making your way, you come across this elevator, and inside of it, one of you finds a pr well. It was a group group effort, and you found yourself a prism. Who has gotten that prism? Me. All right. Kuroi. 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 All right. Very very cool. Where do you store it? Um. Man, that would be really low hanging fruit. But you know what? Stored in your low hanging fruit. Are you gonna put it in your lower mouth? Oh. No. You can perch it right on top of your butt. Ooh. Between. Like, can it in between them cheeks like a credit yeah. card. My uh, chest pocket. Your chest pocket. Very nice. Nice. Very nice. Let, 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 hmm. oh, Which chest? Which chest? The upper one or the lower one? <laughs> <laughs> the upper one, obviously. All right, Just the upper one. Do you even have to ask? All right. Uh, so you've got your prism there. Um, let's do a prism check, PP check. Uh, Xerxes, you have one, yes? Yeah. All right. Where is it? it? Kind of. Uh, right shoulder under plate my or left? Shoulder plate. Uh, no. Right. Okay. Uh, my right, you're right. You also have one as well, yes? No. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Rolling in such DM. Mm, I, yeah, it's it's stored inside my jacket. Alright. And um Typhle? Your prism. <laughs> my prism is uh, uh uh between my boobs. Oh, excellent. Uh, you too? Oh. Great minds think alike, wow. I guess. Wow. All right, Xerxes puts his in between his boobs too. He wants to put Hello, this is this is the one place where girls store everything. What do you mean? This Not is true. true. This is true. And um, Boggle oh, and Roku. Like I believe that both of you are naked. Yes. Oh, Always, no. baby. All right. Wait, Nam wants to store it between after Nam after watching them storing them between their tits. Uh, Nam wants to do the same. It shall be done. You slightly shift it in your jacket because you are quite the yes. expert at sleight of hand. Yes. And All right. Since Nam is so old, he's just gonna. She's just she. gonna store it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank she's you. just gonna store it beneath her hanging boobies. Oh no! Yes. Down by her, down by her knees. Excellent. Actually, those aren't those aren't my knees, no. by the way. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, John, take an inspiration point. You're gonna That's need it. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> What we should be doing right now is perhaps establishing what we should be doing when we reach the floor. Exploring? Uh, we have to go find the prism, don't we? Here's what I propose. I will scour the rooftops or the ceiling, should there be one, and see if perhaps it is lodged in there. If we do encounter number 10, we should probably check and see to make sure that they do have the prism on them. If they do, we must take it by force if necessary. And if they, especially if they do have it, we must not kill them. And the until last after time. we reclaim it. The last time Sorry, tried what did you say? Them. I wasn't listening, what? <laughs> <sighs> you four should stick together while me and Typhoon stick together. If you so wish. We are probably the only ones who will be in the least amount of danger. As you are flying on by here and purveying the water, the both of you can see something that the rest of them do not. It is not dirt at the bottom that makes it dark. The entire bottom of the water is all bone. What you can right. tell is that there is large diversity between them. Hmm. Some are massive, like Shit. representing larger creatures. Some of them are small, 
some of them you see bug carapaces. You don't know what specific ones, but beetle folk is always an easy go-to because beetle folk are the largest population of bug folk. There is a substantial amount of humanoid bones in the water. But no other changes save for the fact that you are looking at that. You keep double backing and ensuring that you check each other's grounds and there has been no change until you hear a small laugh come from a dagger behind you. And you turn and you see Nam throws a drop of blood into the water. And then everything changes. It's not my fault. It's not my fault. <laughs> Literally my every fault. time! Fucking every fire. time! Um, I just love the the thought process of like, ah, oh, the swimming pool is kind of dark. And so let's just bleed into it for a little bit and see what happens. Uh, the bones that were I once mean, visible so to good. the both of you, as the water is settled, the water... And all of the bones simply seem to be dragged downwards. You can no longer see any of the bones that were so visible and clear to you. That is uh, really not good. Uh, wait. Are they alive? Wait, how? What is happening? And you see all of the bones simply moving. Uh, number I think 10? Uh oh. You might have found number 10. Prepare yourselves. I had a suspicious. Uh, Be careful. Can we make a perception check? Ourselves uh, as well? The, the two of you Speed don't food. see it because you just throw it over Xerxes' shoulder. Uh, Roku, for you, the waters seem to change. Whoa, 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 hold on. Hold on now. Unfortunate. <laughs> Unfortunate. Oh. Oh, my Zero God. Zero seven. It was nice playing with you, Chi. <laughs> See you next character. You want to learn Thank the you day. Thank you for joining us. It was a wonderful two sessions. Well, your voice changes on, I saw. God no, damn it. No, no, that's all in character. Yeah. Thank you for joining <laughs> us. <laughs> Bye. All right. Uh, dexterity save, Yochi. Oh, shoot. As you try and fly, as the water moves, just make a dexterity back save. over here so I can give you guidance. Oh, yeah, you Oh! Oh! oh. oh. That's yeah. Awesome. Yeah. oh. You is dead, then. Ah, she should have had her give up the prison earlier so she could really die. Typhle, as you turn the corner, you see something move through the water, and you finally come to where all the bones have gathered. And you realize it was not bone, for it was all an illusion. And something reaches up with several of its oh. mouths and lashes oh towards you. Guys! Jumping this? from the water, its wings uh, sprouting. You have the found number 10. <laughs> All right, there we go. Oh, shit. Oh, that looks sick. All right, I get to make three attacks on you. Let's go. Oh, you're dead. Do you have, you're does dead. he have a Moonlight Greatsword in his back? Son of a bitch. Holy lord. Um, Hi. Uh... Are we fighting on horse with tentacles? Yeah. Nice. That's terrifying. Slashing damage. Right. Okay. Da, da, da. All right. And now that's first one. So that's surprise. And now I get to make my real one. Oh. Okay. Oh my God. So that is going to be <laughs> one. Two, uh, three hits. So that's you speed. are dead. Eleven um, plus five. You got a prison. It's fine. Plus ten. So this is the surprise round damage that I'm going to deal to you. Twenty six. Oh. Damage twenty six. Oh, Not that bad. Boom. Click on my right. health real quick. Oh, he is yeah, going we to just started half health. Grab you, and he's going to pin you up against this. Once oh. he does so. He's going to leave. He's going to leave a bit of the flesh behind, and his arm will sever, keeping you pinned. And now we roll oh, for initiative. 